This is 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 a letter box hidden inside are the documents of civilization parking fines pizza delivery and council notices from the humble photocopies of self-promoting household help to the painstakingly designed brochures of new telephone services. But the letterbox is failing, eroding so slowly that we fail to see the damage wreaked by the onslaught of the digital pipeline. The first sign was the closure of local post offices, something we took for granted as we swallow a mouthful of frozen yogurt from an attractive shop that appeared in its place overnight as if by magic. And then it was the turn of the public letterbox, picked off one by one as if by sniper, disappearing from streets and city maps in a genocidal spree whose only benefit is the exercise of added footsteps taken in search of the next letterbox. What harm, if any, has the humble letterbox caused to arouse such a vicious backlash? And if you say bills, one must stop and wonder how much money we have lost by having bills delivered electronically at the speed of light, advancing our payments as though daylight saving clock windings shortened our lives. It's time to draw a line on the footpath and say, no further. This is my letterbox and I will defend it from the greed of accountants and spam. This is where we take our stand. This is where I say stop no more and take a fresh sheet of paper and begin. Dear Agatha,